Mr. David Ochieng are same, eh? You know, there are, there are, there are few. The next election is 2027. So the idea that there will be a way in which Raila will be president between now and 2027. And our constitution is very clear that if you run in an election, it says that if you get 50 plus one votes, you are the president. Yeah. And so there's a president in place. Let's agree with that fact that there will be no other election. William Ruto got 50 plus one percent and he is the president is going to be here for a while. Number two, I'm getting fearful because the wars that we are fighting now are almost personal wars. Almost personal hatred on the person of the president. Mm. So because if if if, if Raila was president today, we would want to be, to be respected, to be allowed to work. So let's allow the person who has been elected to work. Number three, this talk about we are the people. Kenya Kwanza also are the people. Yeah. Everyone has the people. Yes. So if you say you have more people than us, what about the day you also bring our people out? So so the idea about the people, Nataka to the people depends on where you are. The election that finished showed that Kenya Kwanza had more people than Azimio. That's the truth. And so the idea that, oh, we can use Article 1 of the Constitution, but we are the people, there are more people on this side, and they're just being patient. Finally, I want to keep calling upon my little brothers. Saroba Hotel in Kisumu was not working for three years, was opened two months ago. Why did you break the windows of that hotel? KCB has been there for the last how many years? Why do you break the windows of a bank? Your brothers are working there, your sisters are working there. Now, Governor Nyongo says that people should, people should not target some buildings. He should tell people down there that they should not, they should not target all the buildings. You cannot be saying that today you want to put riot, tomorrow you want them to put buildings, and you are not taking care. And I agree, I agree with my brothers here, that all of us in Kenya Kwanza will do letters to the ORPP that anybody who was injured, even the person who was killed in Maseno, must be paid by the ODM. Thank you so much.